Welcome to Centenary United Methodist Church, offering Christ through service and worship. We are glad you are here. Good morning. My name is Robert Gorell, and I'm the senior minister here at Centenary United Methodist Church. I'd like to welcome all of you who are guests with us today. We're honored that you're worshiping with us. If you'll stop by in this area, the narthex, on your way outside of the sanctuary this morning, we have a very beautiful gift for you. These cups are made by one of our church members, and we'd like to give you one just as our way of saying thank you for worshiping with us. We believe that God has brought you here, and we celebrate you being with us this morning. We want to thank everyone for their donations of ice cream, cookies, and money. Ice cream in the park was such a great success, and that was because of you and your commitment to not only our church, but also our community. Together, we serve our Lincoln School community through our ice cream social. We certainly appreciated our youth and their participation helping to serve and also to play with people in the area. We enjoyed a very nice evening of fellowship and of sharing with one another. Thank you again for all your support in making this such an, a great success. Have you ever noticed the beautiful portraits we have of the apostles in our church? They have a great story behind them. A few years ago, Methodist churches all over the country purchased those portraits to raise money for a special project. They endowed the chair of evangelism in our seminaries all throughout the nation. When I went to seminary, I had a great evangelism professor because you and this congregation gave that wonderful gift. There's so many things in our church that tell a story of faith, generosity, and compassion. We'd like to share that with you, especially if you're new in the church, through a course we call 21 Questions. It meets the first four Sundays in October. We meet in the parlor, and we'll be sharing how Methodists live out their faith, what we believe, and how it guides our daily life. I hope you'll come join us the first four Sundays in October in the parlor for 21 questions. Ladies, I would like to invite you to the next general UMW meeting this coming Monday, October the 2nd at 6 p.m. in the church parlor. There will be a potato salad bar provided and we are having Stephanie Fox, who is a teacher from Lawton High School, coming to talk to us about her homeless students there at the high school. We would also like to give her a little shower of items that she needs deodorant, uh, shampoo, conditioner, body wash, um, belt size 36. She also needs some food items, microwavable sausage biscuits, peanut butter crackers, trail mix and such. Um, we also ask that you just come and enjoy us and find out what we can do to help the homeless students at Lawton High School. This beautiful stole was made for me by our brothers and sisters in Maua, Kenya. Methodist Church there in the Methodist Hospital serves thousands of people. In fact, our hospital there serves over a million people through a small mission hospital. Stanley Amunia, the director of the hospital, will be visiting our church October 18th at 6.30. That's a Wednesday night when we don't have logos and the choir will start a little late so that you can meet Stanley and hear amazing stories about what our mission work is doing in Africa. October 18th at 6.30, come and join us.